Good morning, this is your media report for Friday, June 12, 2015. I'm Sergeant Lori McGee, Media Relations Officer for the St. John Police Force. During the last 24 hours, police have responded to 96 calls for service. We would like to hear from anyone that has any information concerning any of our calls or investigations. We can be reached at 506-648-3333, at our email, police at stjohn.ca, or you can do it anonymously through the Provincial Crime Stoppers at 1-800-222-8477 or on their website at crimeandb.ca. At 8.13 a.m. yesterday morning, contact was made with a 32-year-old male who agreed to turn himself into police. He was arrested for violating a court order to have no contact with a person he is accused of assaulting. He was held in custody for a court appearance. At 8.38 a.m., a 31-year-old male was arrested at his residence on the Land Road for a $50 drive-off without paying for his fuel at the Petrocan on Lachlan Road. He was released to appear in court at a later date. At 10.40 a.m., a 42-year-old male was arrested at a Peter Street residence for failing to comply with the condition of his release to sign in weekly to police. He was held in custody for a court appearance. At 1.15 p.m., a 34-year-old male was on conditions to sign in to police and failed to comply. The accused was living in Fredericton and arrangements were made to meet and he was taken into custody. He was held for court appearance. At 1.36 p.m., police were called to, into the Loyalist burial grounds where they arrested a 41-year-old male for possession of liquor, which was a violation of his court order to abstain. He was held for court. At 3 p.m., a 22-year-old male was arrested in the parking lot of a jury co business after he was found to be doing drugs in his vehicle. The accused was arrested for possession of marijuana and he was released and will appear in court at a later date. At 4 p.m., police were called to the Shoppers Drug Mart on Lansdowne Plaza. A 21-year-old male was arrested for theft as well as violation of a court order. He was held in custody for a court appearance. At 10.30 p.m. last evening, a 29-year-old female was arrested for two outstanding thefts. An officer observed the female on foot at the corner of Adelaide and Main Street North. She was taken into custody and held for court appearance in the morning. At 12.31 a.m. this morning, police received a call to a residence on Robar Court. The caller reports she, just, she had seen somebody going through her vehicle and yelled out. The suspect fled on foot. Police looked in the area and could not, could not locate uh, the suspect. At 1.22 a.m., police conducted a motor vehicle stop on Adelaide Street. A 31-year-old male operator showed signs of impairments. And, impairment, sorry. He was subsequently arrested for impaired driving. He was later released and will appear court at a later date. At 4 a.m., police were approached by a female on Main Street West and advised that she observed a male going through a vehicle parked on Reddy Street. Police checked the area and located a male on Catherwood Street. The 18-year-old male was found to be in possession of stolen property and arrested for that, as well as trespassing at night and breach of probation. He was held in custody for a court appearance this morning. And as just mentioned, in the early morning hours of June 12th, police recovered an amount of property believed to be stolen during car prowls in the Champlain Heights area, centralized at Robar Court. Residents who have had their vehicles disturbed overnight in or near this area are asked to contact City Police at 648-3333. And just a friendly reminder to citizens to lock the doors of your vehicle and keep items of interest out of sight or remove them from the vehicle. This concludes the media report for Friday, June the 12th. Have a great day and be safe.